Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Jasmine Lovely Tara. So good to see you guys here today. Today's video is going to be for my Libras. If you guys resonate with the video, like, share, and subscribe. If you guys have any questions or want personal readings, hit me up at jasminelovely84 at gmail. Today we're using the Luna L Universe Tarot deck with the Delusion Tarot deck, okay? Now remember, I do read the cards, but sometimes the message that the Divine sends for me to channel through to you guys, it's actually different. So, if you resonate with it, great. If you don't, maybe next time. We're starting off with the Page of Wands energy. It's a beginner, right? Page wants created beginner but it's un it's unraveling it's discovering it's shedding shedding the old to be more aligned to the new being as light as you can be when it talks about the heart the body right being as light so that means you have to sh what is that word shed shed the past shed the pain shed the trauma and the deeper you go into this layer of shedding the more you realize what needs to be shed right now sometimes that means you have to take a hard look in the mirror and see yourself as you are and where you're holding yourself back and then still instead of judging yourself for it which you will everybody does we all judge ourselves for where we're not and what's holding our back ourselves back we judge ourselves for it but once we're done with the judging wanting to be accepting and loving then we can shift right we can transition into something that's completely new you have a whole ace here it's an opportunity to discover more of self that's not really functioning with the day-to-day -day. because it starts with the day-to-day -day. what about ourselves when it comes to the deep shedding the deep recognizations of who we are how we're holding ourselves back how can we change that how the opportunity is here you just have to take it now the whole point i you guys are more advanced right which is why i'm reading for the advanced people here you don't give a fuck about the six of cup even if it's there as a presentation you're like okay this ace ain't shit how do I go from turning this ace, which is a bare minimum, discovering who you are, growing little by little, how do we turn this ace of cups into a queen of cups? How do we turn this foundation, this structure of not really knowing what we're doing with this, to how do we get a structure like this where if anybody tried to, try to come in and destroy it, they couldn't. Even if I tried to come in and self-sabotage and destroy it, I couldn't. How do we go from an ace to a queen of cups? Look at the difference in structure, huge. Willing to take fountains and drips or whatever, even, even the color in this is different from black to light, being more optimistic, more loving me, more structured, more able to take in anything that, it, that, 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 that comes about it and then just letting it through. Some of you guys aren't thinking of the ace, you're thinking of the queen. How do we get from an ace to a queen here? Well, it's a big transformation. You guys are big. This is what I'm saying. You guys are really advanced. Every time you see an ace, you get to a 10, you see an ace, you're like, this ain't shit. All right, this is another opportunity. I'm going to take it. How do I convert an ace to a queen? See, this is why I know you guys are just so beyond. Okay? We're not talking about a regular beginner, regular person. We're talking about somebody that thinks miles ahead. You think light years ahead. You think, how can I go from here to here? This is why someone like you is unstoppable. You think you're slow. You think you're moving at a snail's pace. You think you're this, you're that, but you're not. Because when someone sees an ace, they're like, oh, it's a whole opportunity. How do I set myself up for this? No, you guys aren't thinking that. You guys are looking at this ace and thinking, how do I set this fucking little shit here? How do I make this into this? You're thinking long term. You're thinking longevity. You're thinking structure. You're thinking addition. You're thinking this is just another layer to my life. And then I'm going to add another fucking ace and convert it into a queen. So I want three queens or a king and a, and a whatever. And I'm going to make it miles high. Mile plus mile plus mile high. Okay? 
So, but let's take it one step at a time here. You got a ten of pentacles, right? Again, when I tell you you guys are the wisest, I don't just say it to fluff you up and make you feel good about yourself. I'm saying this because you guys are the most ambitious, okay? You're more ambitious than you could ever fucking believe, okay? Ambition to the point where you're at a ten of pentacles and you're thinking, how do I magnify the structure? How do I add this ten into another ten? Into another ten? Into another ten? I want, I want a Benji plus. How do I add this on top of another layer and another layer? Well, as a page of wands, although you're new and shutting and healing, you have to think. Because again, some of you guys are wondering how, 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 how the opportunity is there and you're taking it. When I see you taking this opportunity, right, it's shedding. We're talking about shedding again. Shedding, releasing, discovering a new layer of what needs to be looked at within self and transition within self, transmuted so that you can heal it, purge it, and become somebody else. But we gotta go back to basics, okay? Because you guys are thinking long-term, but it's like, well, if you guys wanna do long-term, you have to see it where you're at. Have you accepted that this is the conditions you're in, you were born with, the situation you're in, and once you accept it, can you transmute it and then move forward, right? Because all you see is a queen of cups instead of the ace, Right? When you see an ace, you see a queen. How do I transmute it into a queen? Well, here you are. A four of cups. And this is matters of the heart. Matters of, of, of this, is, this is like childhood self-belief that's restricting you from becoming an ace to a queen. How do I restructure this so that this becomes more of the person that I want to be? Have you 100% accepted that you're still holding on to things that define you as a person that you are now? And if you know who you are, if you see where the damage is, if you see that you're still correlating the you that you are now with the past, how can you shed that? How can you heal that so that you can move the fuck forward? Right? Because I'm giving you the stats. I'm giving you a formula. Right? You guys are long-term thinkers here. Have you accepted that where you are is no longer where you want to be? Right? Because you can think and dream all day long about a Queen of Cups. But how can you convert into the Queen of Cups if you haven't accepted where you're at? Once you accept where you're at, are you willing to change? Are you willing to take the steps necessary to convert into a Queen of Cups? Because this is a big, mighty project if you ask me. From an ace to a queen, honey. It's a big fucking project. I mean, even the nighttime to the daytime, it's a whole different fucking vibration here. Vibration, it's different. And then the four of cups, right? It's like you're here and you want to add another structure or you want to believe that you can align to this. How can you align to a better structure? How? You're there. You guys are literally there, which is why you're drawn to this reading. It's like, how do we go about it to change that? What leap of faith do you need to take in order for you to get to that next step? Since you guys are that fucking ambitious. If you weren't, I wouldn't be talking to you right now. It's that simple. Mm. Ooh, we're in a nine with ten. I mean, you guys, here you are. The truth has been given to you. You asked the question to the divine. The divine gave you the answer. What are you going to do to change that? What course direction do you need to set to get you to the fucking Queen of Cups that you want so bad? You want the structure, but you're barely here. What are you going to do to change that? There's a huge amount of steps I need to take in order for you to get that structure. But you guys see it and you're going to make it happen. I don't doubt one bit that you're going to make that shit happen for yourself. So this is just the thinking process, the blueprint to get you where you need to be. I'm all for it. All right, guys, that's all I have for you, my beautifuls. Take care. Bye.